we do not rely on price as a methodology to grow our business. It's built around uh, a one price policy providing different products, quality, uh, value that we needed to get back into these freestanding stores like where we are today because this is where we see for the next 20 years. At the same time, you know, there's a lot of competition uh, in the jewelry industry and just in, the, in retailing as a whole, uh, and whether that comes from the internet or from different sources. So to make the shopping experience fun and enjoyable is a big challenge, to uh, create an environment where people want to come and they want to spend time. A matter of fact, I want to I show you a, a grounding situation that, we've, that we uh, found over here when we came into Carmen's house. Okay. Um, take a look. Stay tuned to learn how you can do your own in-home electrical safety evaluation. This is pretty much typical, Steve, believe it or not. This here is a ground clamp that grounds the house, all right? Um, so when we're, when we're talking about different things that people can look for in their houses, this, this is another one of those things they can look for. Um, follow your water pipe up and take a look at your electrical ground clamp. And if that ground clamp looks anything like that, mm -hmm. you need to call an electrician immediately because chances are your house is no longer grounded. This is the new circuit breaker panel that we installed. As you can see, this is a 200 amp service. It's a big difference now. Now this house is, is properly grounded and um, it's gonna be good for another 50, 60 years. Oh yeah, we're pretty much set in here, Steve. And this is something that really fascinated me when I was watching Scott work on this. Yeah. And I, when you talk about that old work wiring. Well, this is a classic example of uh, what we were talking about before, old work wiring, where um, there isn't a receptacle there now, or in some cases there isn't a light fixture there now, and our customers want us to put in a light fixture or an outlet. This is a, from a very old very old fragment. It probably was 18th century. So it's, it's a very old piece. Um, the pieces here, these pieces actually came from the same piece. The inserts on these pillows are actually French as well, and they're from an aubusson, which is another carpet. This would have been a wall hanging. This was actually a flat woven carpet. But similar tones, this is newer. Marianne, I really like the way the rooms kind of all flow together with the rugs when you have the beige jars and you come into the living room with that. But going off into the dining room here, a little bit of a different look. It looks like the rugs complement each other, but that rug looks a little bit different. Can you explain what right. we're looking at? Well, that rug is actually called a Hariz. It's mm -hmm. from the Hariz region, also from Iran or old Persia. Uh, mainly I've been doing watercolors um, for probably the past 10 years. And I do uh, acrylic also. I've done some sculpting, but I primarily do watercolor. I tend to paint um, architecture or something with architecture in it. I like character of like homes or buildings, something different about them. I like to kind of capture the character of, of a house or um, some, type, some type of architecture. I see when patients have to move on to another level of care that they tend to decline quite quickly because you have other people doing things for you. We're at your own home, you have to go up the stairs to get to your bed, to get to your shower. And that going up the stairs helps increase your strength in your legs, cardiovascular system. Um, and I think people have to be healthier to stay at home. Hi, I'm Governor Jody Rail, and it is with great pride that I welcome you to ctparenting.com a new website brought to you by the Department of Children and Families. Whether you're a mom or a grandmother like me, a dad, a divorced or foster parent, or even a soon-to-be parent.
I did this first one, um, I am not afraid of heights anymore. Really?